Hi guys, so I'm here to do my Christmas book haul and um, what I got for Christmas. So sorry I sound so tired and look like crap, but I am pretty tired. I worked a lot over Christmas and I was just at a stage where I just had to get these videos done. So sorry about that, but hopefully this video doesn't suck too much. So the first set of books I got, I know a lot of people have a lot of mixed opinions about these books, but do you know what? Everyone's allowed their own opinion and I like them. So I got the white Twilight covers as a present. But do you know what? If you like it, you like it. And that's just, that's that. So, Twilight, New Moon, which this one looks a bit dirty, but I have washed it. But I don't know if this red and white idea was such a good idea on for them, but I think they look good and they look really good next to the black ones. A clap. And Breaking Dawn. So that's those four. Okay, so next up is Never Cry Never Cry Werewolf by Heather Davis. This is kind of about a kid who sort of gets sent to Brat Camp and ends up being like a, she meets like a, a fellow camper who turns out to be a wolf. So that sounds pretty good. Next up is The Immortals by Alison Knoll. Um, I got the first one in this series just to see what it was like to be taster. So, kind of like, um, so this is about a girl and she can feel the aura of people around her. And when she touches people, she can see things from the past and the future, etc. So, I'm not really sure. It's not. It, look, it sounds alright. And I've heard quite a lot about it, so give it a bash. Next up, I got um, I treated myself. This was my present to me. Um, Elixir by Hilary Duff. So, I don't know about it. It's on one of my top my top 11 books to be read next year, so I will read it. I just don't know. I've heard so many different things about it, but I can only wait and see. Next up, I got Hush Hush by Baker Fitzpatrick. This seems to be very big now, and well, especially our next one, Crescendo, but need to read this one first before I can read that so can't wait to get into that one. Next up I have both by Andy Briggs, villain.com and oh sorry villain.net and hero.com. I've already read villain.net and it wasn't brilliant. I mean it, it was good but it wasn't amazing Um, but I don't know there's just something I wanted to read it's kind of like they kind of mix and mash, I mean that's about the villains, that's about the heroes, but they kind of intertwine with each other, I mean those characters appear in that one, etc. But no thing is, because I read the villain one first, I'm thinking I might not like the hero one so much, so I know you might say like the heroes and all the villains, but I think I like it other way because I read that one first, but anyway, we'll just need to wait and see. So those are the other two I got. Also got from my mum and dad, um, I already have some of them, so it was just to kind of completely say it, and it's the... Harry Potter audiobooks. Um, there's just something about the way Stephen Fry reads that I just completely love, and especially falling asleep to him. Oh, only thing it's not good at he's not good at Professor McGonagall's voice. He makes her sound like an Irish old man. But everyone else, oh, he's just got to laugh, and he's just he's just got this amazing. He's just so good at reading them and. It's the only audio books I've ever listened to and I tried listening to another one but every time I was listening to it all I could think was he's no Stephen Fry and no one can feed so anyway I love audio books so this one is I've already got the first two and Lord of the Phoenix so this is the Prisoner of Azkaban um, The Goblet of Fire and my favourite, which I have been so excited to get, can't wait to get into it, is The Half-Blood Prince. Oh, it's going to be amazing hearing it. I mean, I've already heard it. I did have these books ages ago, but unfortunately me being an idiot didn't save them in my computer. And I lost them when my computer went and died on me. Completely unrestorable. So I can't wait and I've decided if I was get them on the actual CD instead of buy them off iTunes because I just couldn't get them back. And I finally got them back. So I'm only missing the last one, 
but my birthday's not too far away and hint hint people, that's what I will be wanting but I can't wait to get into this one, it's so exciting so that's my book haul guys, so hope you enjoyed and I will see you next time, bye!